Hello and welcome to this intermediate C# -sharp scripting course for Unity game development. After finishing this course, you will be able to take your C# -sharp skills to the next level. We will start by learning the basics of C# -sharp with a C# -sharp scripting crash course. Then we will dive into learning about data structures in C# -sharp and how to implement them in Unity. After that, we can learn about object pooling with a lot of practical examples and how you can use it in your own games. After finishing that, we can learn about vectors and vector maths and we will implement them using C# -sharp in Unity and we will also take a look at some examples how you can use it in real games. Then we can learn about quaternions and rotations and how Unity handles quaternions to make things clear for you. After that, we can learn about object oriented programming concepts in C# -sharp, and finally, we will learn about miscellaneous intermediate C# -sharp scripting concepts and finish the course. So if you are ready to upgrade your C# -sharp scripting skills, enroll now, get started and I will see you inside the course. Hello and welcome to Intermediate C# -sharp scripting for Unity game development course. Thank you so much for taking this course. So in this video, let's discuss what you're going to be learning inside. So let's get started. So first of all, here we have a section called Unity C# -sharp scripting crash course. This is an optional section. So if you are new to C# -sharp scripting, you can brush up your skills in this section. But this is optional. So if you have already taken any of my previous C# -sharp courses or if you already have some idea about Unity C# -sharp scripting, you can skip this part. Next, we're going to start learning about data structures and how we can implement different data structures like lists or stack and queues and dictionaries in C# -sharp in Unity specifically. After that, we're going to learn about object pooling with some practical examples. So you're going to learn what is object pooling, why do we need it and how we can implement an advanced version of object pool in Unity using C# -sharp. Then, we're going to learn about vector maths and vectors in Unity using C# -sharp. so you're going to learn all about vectors and vector maths and how you can use and implement vectors using C# -sharp and use them in real game projects next we're going to learn about quaternions now quaternions are something that confuses a lot of people but in these videos i'm going to try to make these things as simple as possible for you after that you're going to learn about different object oriented programming concepts in C# -sharp and implement them on your code and finally, you're going to finish this course with some different miscellaneous intermediate C# -sharp scripting concepts. So these are the things that you're going to be learning in this course. Now, with that done, let's talk a little bit about myself so that you can know who I am. My name is Raja and I'm founder of Charger Games and I've been teaching game development and computer programming for last several years. I also have some best-selling courses here. Also, on my YouTube channel, I have a lot of popular videos on game development and computer programming and I've been teaching for last 7-8 years and also some of my videos have over 1 million views. So with that said, thank you so much for taking this course. I'm really excited. I hope you are excited as well. So let's get started learning.